what were the challenges that were presented that you had to overcome to turn this match around? Well, I played really bad. <laughs> uh, it, I don't you know. It wasn't my best match today. Um, so I just had to kind of just fight myself in that beginning. And I just kept telling myself, you know, so in Australia, you lost the first set a few times. And you just stay calm and just stay in it. And ultimately, that helped me out. And what kind of improvements do you wish to have going forward into your third match where it's a potential matchup with the former number one, Azarenka? Um, you know, I'm practicing unbelievable. I mean, I didn't see that today. If you saw my practices, you would be surprised. So, I mean, if I could just play the way I've been practicing every single day, I would be fine. So I really don't think outside of my serve, because I haven't had a lot of time to serve, I don't really need a, t a lot to improve on. But obviously today in the match, I need to just completely start over. You joked after your first round win that you were happy you defended your points from mm -hmm. last year. Can you compare the pressure you're feeling this year going for major number 20 and you're already halfway through your second Serena Slam? Um, I don't really feel any pressure. I, I really feel like, um, you know, getting at 19 was a great feat and a great number. So I feel no matter what I do, I, I will always have a great career. Um, but at the same time, you know me, I, I always want to do well. But to be honest, the pressure is really kind of off me right now.